Previously on Zakia Loves Pinto. You know, why go on? You ready, you ready, you ready? <laughs> because they say that he's not a British citizen. I don't know a country where it's really benefited us. You eat fruits and vegetables and snacks. There's yes. no discrimination. That's okay. I <laughs> exactly. Say that. My body goes is if I put forth the effort. I try to work out about three, four times a week, but as of lately, it's only been once or twice. I would like to do more, but at the moment, I'm not able to. But as soon as I get back up to it, I'm gonna be going ham in the gym. Got my little sweatsuit. I'm going to sweat it out. Let's go. Babe, I got your water. <sighs> My dog always rushing me to get to the gym. I'm just always trying to make sure I'm on time for her so we can get things done. Yeah, you know, summer bodies only come in the winter time, so gotta put that time in. Come on, babe! But, yeah, we're gonna go to the gym and get a good workout in. I really need to lose like this belly part. Ever since I was little, I battled with my weight. I feel like I probably had some type of body dysmorphia um, as I was growing up. Uh, everyone around me, all the girls around me, you know, had skinnier bodies and I just wanted to look like them. So, um, <laughs> it's so funny because I'll look at pictures of me younger and I'll be like, I wasn't actually that big. I really wasn't that big. I was pretty small. But in my mind, when I looked in the mirror, all I saw was someone that was fat, which is really kind of crazy. Um, I have now been able to kind of heal those different things and feel more confident in my own skin. But it's still a battle. Because, like, I don't like this. I really don't like this extra skin part from my stomach. So, we're gonna work. All right. I'm ready, baby. Let's go. I forgot the doggy bags. I gotta go back and get the doggy bags. Come on, Salah. Take your time, baby. Come on. Let's go. Okay, are we gonna do this today? Oh my gosh, I love my babies. I've never had animals throughout my life. I had one bird that flew away, um, but having four dogs, um, I never knew what to expect walking into it, but over time you start to develop the relationship and you actually see that they actually love you. So um, I love my babies. Come on, come on baby. Good girl. There we go. Let's go. Y'all want to be a trio so bad. Salah is the only one that can take her time down the stairs. Everybody else, no excuse. <sighs> Salah. Salah, that's my baby. That's my firstborn. She is everything to me she's been here through the ups and the downs the struggles you know she literally has been I, I couldn't imagine this life without her she has been so um just an important person in my life when in days when i was sad or mad she knew how to comfort me she has just been everything and she's getting older and um, it's really tough kind of thinking about how the next coming years, how things will start to change. 
um, I really can't imagine not having her in my life. Uh, and every day, I try to cherish her because she's so important to me. I got you and your vibes in my mind. I can get them out no matter how hard I try. I need you and your heart next to mine. Yeah, I'm all about keeping it you and I. When you're here, you spark chemical reactions. Thank you. Oh, she was like, babe, I can't do this. Our lifestyle now is that we eat fruits and vegetables during the week, very clean, trying to eat very clean. And then during the weekends, we can have, you know, our little treats here and there, yeah. but not go overboard. Yeah. Um, and then we also, if we have a craving, we... We have it. We have it. We have whatever we want, but we don't overindulge in that craving. That's where people go wrong, That's right? That's why I went wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's where we went wrong. Okay? <laughs> Overindulging. So we just try to handle the craving. Yeah. And walk away. And walk away. And don't look back. <laughs> <laughs> I have a headache. I've been feeling chills. My body is hurting. I can feel the blood pumping through my veins. I have to, I can't do this. I can't do this way of eating during the weekends. I have to have a solid meal once a day. So I'm gonna have pizza once a day and then we'll eat vegetables and fruits. I said, all right, babe, whatever. If that, if that helps, then okay. I love pizza. I love pizza, okay? Pizza is, pizza is life. <laughs> Do I eat pizza every day? No, I don't eat pizza every day, but if you don't like pizza, like, what's wrong with you? Okay, I love pizza. I'm sorry. As long as it works for you. I don't want you out here passing out, okay? Not on my watch. So, um, anyways, now nah, she, she really did good this week. She didn't have no pizza, even though she was talking all that mess. I knew that she can do it. So, you got to have a good gym workout. Yep. She decided to walk instead of um, riding in the car with me. So I'm gonna meet her there. I'm gonna get some cardio in and then that's that. It's hot as hell. That's one thing about living in the valley. You gonna get the first degree of heat wave before anybody else. So you just breathe through your nose. Out your mouth. In that place in my relationship. I don't know, we got a lot of cranberry juice. These look kind of good. 